Hi, I'm Daniel Hogan. I'm the Pest Control Officer for Origin Housing. We're going to be talking about some issues with mice and rats. So as we go around this kitchen, I'm just going to show you the sort of cases. Wherever there's pipes, uh, that means there's entry points. It's a nice big hole. Uh, anything that a biro pen can fit in, an adult mice can come through it. So that is pretty large. You'll see they've been coming out of here and along here. You can see that marks that have been breaking and teething. They will use these cold water pipes that obviously to come up or to come out of your walls. Um, we're going to look behind the cooker today. On cookers, when you're cooking, bits of fat run down. Because we live in central London, we've got plenty of McDonald's, KFCs, kebabs, all this sort of high content food. Um, and the mice and the rats have got custom to this high content in fat. Now, <coughs> mice have very small stomachs. All they have to do is lick that fat and they're getting full up. And then as we look down, most people don't pull their cookers out. And this is one of the reasons that we get mice in the first place because fat sits down there, food droppings get caught down there. Again, fridges, great hot spots. You can actually see it's lovely and warm. They're hidden, it's dark. If we're going to leave any sort of food out, then make sure that they're in some sort of containers or they're in cupboards that are up here we ask them to keep their rice in the containers it doesn't take a minute to put them in something like that I would say to you yes it's about being clean but no matter how clean you are if mice want to visit they will definitely visit so if you give them no food they won't stay if they find food source they're going to stay we start off use something like this this is called excluder we'll poke this in the hole so we just block it off just like that you you at home can also do this as well we do recommend if you see a little hole block it with a little bit of wire wool maybe put a bit of silicone over it to hold it into place it's not pretty but it serves the purpose your builders or anybody that's doing that can make it look cosmetic this is our galvanized meshing and we always make sure that we oversize it so no mouse can chew through this pipe it's now blocked wire purely to the wall so as of today we've blocked the holes in we can see the actual bait station is empty so we're going to replenish that we'll then lock our box so it's now tamper proof. Please leave the boxes alone. Do not touch them. They contain rodenticide. We'll pop this back here for a week. We'll come back and we will check. But that should be the last of their visits for today. So that is mice. If you have any issues or you need any help, please call us and we'll be there to help you. Thank you for your time.